Coverage Wednesday. It's National Puzzle Day. We are trying our hand at picking up the pieces, and we've got a whole variety here. I feel like we're having a play date or a yes, slumber party. Yes, we I see the piece right here. Well, wait, Brian, I was just thinking we were talking like adult puzzles, like those yeah. huge ones that my friend Brian out there watching loves to put just out on his kitchen table and you oh, come yeah. over and put a piece. Reagan loves them too. Uh, you spend hours on those. Hours, but they come in different, uh, like different shapes and sizes. And themes and, and things themes. like that. Okay, so over here on the right side, the we book? have the giant hidden puzzle. Well, is that's that this not one? giant. Uh, no, that one is a block one. Okay, which um, one's the giant hidden one? But that one is like you find hidden secrets. This one, the book right here? Puzzles, yeah. Both this of book. those. Okay, let me see. It's like the Where's Waldo. Yeah. Do you find more... those relaxing though or frustrating? Both. Yeah. Both. Yep. Both. My kids love these. So though. we're looking for like hidden things inside these photos. Yes. You're saying. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the one on the floor is the they say the largest or longest hidden picture puzzle ever. Oh, oh this so is same a thing, on but floor? on the floor. Yeah. Oh. Right. Can we bring that one? See how long so that goes. So it's not the hidden word in there. It's the hidden item. thing in the item in the yeah. picture. Yes. Okay. And what wow. I do is like cheat because the back has all the clues. You cheat? Well, I cheat. I, I find something on the page and then oh, tell Ellen what I did. What you are the rules? Because they're you like, where is it? I'm like, I don't, I don't know. know. By the way, so good for your brain, whether you're a kid yeah. or mm -hmm. an adult, whatever your age is, all of these brain games are so good yes. for you. It like kind of tricks you into thinking and it gets those those wheels churning. It is yeah. fun. I was actually doing puzzles it just is. last night. Were you? Yeah, sure. Yeah, I did. Like the dinosaur puzzle. Yeah. I like little ones. Okay, okay, so I'm seeing how you put the block puzzle together. Well, they have different ones. So, yeah. Brian, you've got the 3D puzzle. Yeah, so and you can they do have this, little cards, right? And you make the image you see I right like here. I like that kind of thing. Or you can fun. do this one, one like this. Yes. Same thing. Okay. So you can work on that, Brian. All right. Um, then we've got um, this puzzle right here, which is fun. It's from so cute. Um, Banana Panda. And they have all these themed oh, ones. Oh, if like, you have someone that loves astronauts, yes, like, look how space cool that is. Or an space. explorer. Mm -hmm. Uh, this one is great because it's a Planets. wonderful thing. And by, I, the, by the way, Pluto made it on the puzzle. Oh, it's yeah. <laughs> Pluto? Right. When yeah. I was little and I would put something like this together, I didn't want to take it apart, so we'd have to like glue it and put it on cardboard. And yeah, then Pluto it would be done forever. I know, Brian, is, is it a true, true planet? I mean, I think well, it, it is. It made the puzzle. No, it's now. Oh, geez, that's how let you know. It, right? it's, it's a dwarf planet. It's a dwarf Yeah. It used to be a planet, then they downgraded to something else, and now it came back as a dwarf planet. Where's Joetta? Where is she? Is she out here? There she is. Puzzle. This puzzles. is our, our Joetta that, like, uh, she's on camera is at one today, yeah. so wave at us, Joetta. She does puzzles, and then you actually do glue yours together, and she takes them in to places like Comic-Con and has them signed. Yeah. And she frames okay. them and displays them, oh, and she's idea. done some incredible puzzles. Okay, mm -hmm. Dina, you're working on another 3D puzzle. It's called Plus Plus. Um, this one's fun. Ages 3 to I'm 7. I'm into it. I'm feeling it. And this is very similar to with the 3D one where the one Brian has, they have pictures and you have to color code with each piece. What right? this is, I find I this, this one really good for kids to yeah, do. Why is this so satisfying nice when you get it in there and you're like, I did it? Yes. There's something about it that you accomplished. You accomplished. It. Yeah, you did something for the day. Yeah. I think and this is where your picture. kids get it. So you're not actually accomplishing get, a whole I'm lot. I'm getting there. <laughs> there was a whole other design. <laughs> so you guys at home celebrate National Puzzle Day with whatever puzzle that you like. Oh, you're a, a troublemaker. Variety. Yeah, Brian, you're not doing so well, hard. I'm doing great. It just takes a minute. Watch our list. Like, we'll, we'll post these, too. So if you saw a puzzle that you like, right. we'll tell you where yes. you right. I just find it. I got a nice portion Dina, done. nicely I'm proud. Done. I do feel accomplished. Do I'm done with the day. I'm nicely going home. Done. Okay. All well, right. We have more work to do. Up next, everybody, all you're right. getting gorgeous curls without putting your hair through all the heat. When Brian's you're done with curls. The puzzles, Brian's right? curls without a curling yes. iron. There we next. go. Then mind-blowing simple.